Hey. Stop opening it! Hey, what's going on guys? CJR here today with my sons, Teddy. You want to say hi? Hi. And Andrew. Hi. And we are coming at you with another um, Tokyo Treat unboxing. Uh, Tokyo Treat is a monthly mail order treat service all the way from Tokyo, Japan. Filled with Japanese treats. If you're at all interested, I urge you to check out the link in the description below. Uh, the boys are pretty sick, so there might be some coughing in this episode. So bear with us. All right, you guys ready to open this? <laughs> You want to say it, Andrew? Let's open it. Let's open it. Okay, I'm gonna put it to this side. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up. We're gonna go through each thing and then give each thing a little taste test. All right, you ready? Yeah. yeah. You open it. Yeah. Teddy gets a bit grabby over there, so I'm gonna put it on Andrew's side. Okay, let's see what this is first. Oh, this is like a little. Oh, cool! Like a little brochure, and it opens from um, from left to right, not instead of right to left. Typically in North America, we open um, right to left. It opens the opposite way. I th that's a big, uh, that's how they do it in Japan. So that's cool. I really like that that's authentic. What do we got here? We got, uh, as always, the list of items for the month. Daddy? Look, they sent a little book this time. Uh, okay, a uh, little um, thing on the Yokai Watch snack that's apparently in here. Um, Looks like there's a little Pokemon Yokai Watch Mini in here. That's cool. A uh, greeting letter. Oh wow, that's smart. Okay, so the premium box, um, there's three tiers and the uh, premium box usually comes with a couple uh, kits that require some assembly, but sometimes it's tough because it's in Japanese and they can be quite elaborate. So they've actually included some diagrams this time. Full color, really, really nice diagrams too. Typically I watch YouTube videos on it, but uh, really cool that they included that. And then we've got um, just some information on Japan. That's really cool. Uh, famous Japanese places. Very cool. I really like that. I, I really love this uh, Tokyo treat box. Um, I'm a huge fan of Japan. I've never been there, but uh, I've always been fascinated with Japan and Japanese culture. So a very cool addition. Uh, you're going to need that so we can look up what we got in here, okay? You're not feeling good, are you? You got a headache? Well, we're going to open what's first. Oh, I know what these are. Yeah. These are Daddy's favorite. Oh, okay, yeah, so I've had these before through Tokyo Treat. I think this might be a different brand. Uh, Tahato Caramel Corn. Hopefully the camera's picking that up. Daddy, you guys ready? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I have one. Yep. There's two for Ted. Oh, they smell amazing. Yeah. A couple for Andrew. Oh my god. As I always say, uh, these um, like fried, I don't know if this one's probably corn based, corn or rice based typically. Fried snacks, these are my my weak point. I absolutely love these. So now they call this caramel corn, but I see that there's an ice cream cone on there also. And I think it might be ice cream flavored. I've had uh, chocolate and I can't remember what the last one was, but it was delicious. You like that? Yeah. You want one more? What do you think, Andrew? You don't like it. That's crazy. Andrew's not feeling well. Okay, another uh, similar type snack. This one has, you wanna look it up? Can you find it there? Oh, actually, okay, so I should've got Andrew. Okay, so let's look at the first one. The first one here, this is actually Yokai Watch. That must be a Yokai Watch, a, a that must be a Yokai on the front. Um, soft serve ice cream flavored. Those were amazing. Actually, I think that's my favorite of, of those that we've had. Okay, this is the next one, right? Yeah. Tyrant Habanero, who came back. Crunchy rings, delicious and dangerously addictive. Enjoy the spice of real habanero peppers. You guys? No, I don't want yeah? I don't want to <laughs> Try it, Ted. I don't try it. You try it. Mm. I like it? <coughs> it's spicy. <laughs> Is it too spicy? Okay, eat one of these quick. It'll make it better. Sorry, buddy. That was a mean trick. They're not that hot, to be honest. He's just a... better? No. 
Here, eat two more and it'll, it'll feel better. So habanero uh, corn snacks. Really good, not super hot to be honest. I try and keep it uh, organized a little bit here. What do we got, some more Yokai Watch? Can you look it up, where is it bud? Right here? Yokai Watch Fortune Steel Namaste Curry. So more, uh, hey, 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 Ted. Okay. So some more uh, corn snacks here. There we go, one for Andrew. They look like mini Funyuns. Eat it, Ted, don't worry, it's not hot. Curry flavored. So Yokai Watch must be massive in Japan right now, I would assume. Didn't really catch on here. That's not hot. You tell me, right? Okay, Ted, we'll have a little drink here. So, okay, we got a little drink. Where is it? Okay, so this is a Mizaki high quality sweet cake. So it's gonna be sweet. I'm guessing it might be uh, thick. Typically they're thick. I'll try it first. Mm-hmm. And it's lumpy. I'm, I'm gonna try it. That's typical of Japanese drinks like this. They, um, I've been finding. They'll have little chunks of, um, that one tastes like it's got a uh, little, it's got little pieces of something. You like it? Yeah. I like that. That's good, right, Ted? Good. Cayenne Land Candy. So this is one of the kits included this month. The kits are really cool. Um, I actually have a couple stocked up upstairs just because they take a while to do, but they're, they're awesome. Kids love doing them. Okay, so this is a Neru Neru Nerune soda flavor. I believe we've actually had this before, and uh, that doesn't look too complicated. Looks like we just need a little bit of water, so we're gonna go ahead and, and we'll do this one at the end of the video. Fuku Fuku Thai chocolate. Very cool. Um, it's got a fish on the front, so I don't know how that's gonna be chocolate. I want to try it. want to try it? I want to try it. I want to try it. See what we got here. I want to try it. Oh, look at that. Very cool. Yeah, it's really? a fish. Looks like a wafer kind of thing. How do you get the first bite? You bite a piece of the tail, okay? Mm. Hey. Oh, mm. that looks good. Mama. Oh my. Really light, airy, um, like bubbly chocolate in there. It's very, very light. Fantastic. Take Pikachu. Take Pikachu. I like Pikachu. You like Pikachu? Yeah, Pikachu. Pikachu. Where is it? Pikachu. Let me see Pikachu. Pokemon wafers. We've had these before. I want to try. Better show you guys here. That's a Pokemon kind of chocolate wafer. We've had these before, different uh, variations, I think, though. The first time. I remember last time. Look what's in there. Mm -hmm. Wow. Show everybody. Show them the sticker. That's a Pokemon. I think I actually know who that is. I think that's Eve Evie, maybe? Let me know, guys. Evie, I think. Daddy, take Pikachu. Melt, melt in your mouth. Winter Pocky. I've never seen this variation oh, before. Oh, uh, that is very hot. Wow, that looks extra chocolatey. Mm. You want one, Andrew? Yeah. Oh my. Daddy, we had these. A little bit darker chocolate, kind of like a truffle, um, cocoa chocolate. Daddy, we had these. No, we had these, not this type though. No. We had the pink ones. We've had pink ones, we've had green ones. Always love Pocky. This is the one thing we actually can get here. Some variations at least. Right here. Chocolate try. ball peanut. I want to try. Popular staple for Japanese Kids. living That's candy. for many years. I want to try. I want to try. So it looks like little chocolate peanuts. Very cool. I love the Japanese packaging. It's amazing. Teddy, look at that. You get the first one, okay? Okay. Oh, one for Andrew. I ate it. It's a chocolate-covered peanut with a candy or a, 
like a chip coating on the peanut and then covered in chocolate. Excellent. Mm -hmm. What do we got here? Check that out, Ted. Pikachu. Pikachu. Look. We're going to open one here. Mm -hmm. I think these are candies. Maybe you guys can take these to school. Uh -huh. Oh, wow. Two for you. It looks like these are pineapple flavored. I want to try one. They look like vitamins. So, little uh, Pokemon candies. These are pineapple. Tastes like a pina colada. Those are really good. Let's see if it lists what flavors. Okay, so we got pineapple, cola, soda, cola, soda, grape. Five types of melon flavors. See, it comes in a big long strand here, which is awesome for the kids. I want to try one. I just gave you one, buddy. Yeah. I'm gonna move on. We're gonna keep moving here. Okay. So up next, we got the Pokemon sticker matching chewing gum. Open it. Open this up. Open it. Okay, so we got the Pokemon. Pokemon sticker matching chewing gum. Yeah, it looks like there might be some stickers. Oh, I want that big one. Oh, look at that. Oh, I want that big one. Okay, I don't think Teddy really cares about the stickers, right, Ted? Yeah. And then we got a little gum inside. That's it. I want to try So you got two stickers and a little gum in there. I hate stickers. You hate stickers? Yeah. That's not nice. You don't want that? Okay, um, and then finally, we have Pokemon Chewing Candy. I want to open it. Pokemon Chewing Candy. Open Pokemon and Yokai Watch all this week. Oh, look at that. It's a stick of gum. You open that, Ted? Okay. Andrew? Oh, look at that. You got uh, Charmander, I think. Open it. I don't really know my Pokemon. Let me have her. Hey, just open it. Oh, that looks good. You got it, Ted? Take a bite. Take a bite. You good? Yes. Okay, let's leave it right there because we got to try one more thing. Okay, and finally, there's one last thing in here. Uh, Pokemon Monaco 12 Species Assortment. So it's an assortment of Pokemon. And the one we got, it's in Japanese. So if anybody knows this Pokemon, I sure don't. That uh, looks like a newer Pokemon to me. Let me know in the comments below if you know his name. Okay, so we are going to do this little kit here because it looks relatively quick and easy. We're going to do it together here. Okay, so this is the Naru 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 Nace um, soda flavor. So look, Teddy, watch this. We're going to mix this up. I'll try to show you guys here the best I can. Okay, so we've got uh, three three different packets here. This is typical um, numbered packages that you kind of mix up. Okay, so we're gonna pour the first package into the uh, little bowl that it comes with here. Another very typical. It usually comes with its own bowl, mixing spoons. And it uh, usually gives you like a little spoon here to show you how much water to use. So I'll just scoop that. So we'll get one spoonful. Another half, maybe. Water. So you can see here, well, hopefully you can see, I'm just kind of mixing this together. Now it says put pack number two in. I want a ball. It's for me. And I can see it's already starting to, <coughs> when I mix the second one in there, it's starting to kind of foam up. We put it package number three. It's full of little candies. Candy, the more candies. So as you can see here, hopefully you can see that. We got the fluffy paste and then the little candies here. It says to let this sit for a little bit, but it's pretty fluffed up already. Okay, so you take your puffed little marshmallow paste thing here and roll it on the spoon. And then you dip it in the candies. Oh, Open up. What do you think? 
Is it sweet? Yeah. I like this one. You like it, Ted? Mm, it was a little more. It was a little more. You want, you want more? You like that one? I think I'm just going to try the paste. Dad, oh. I want to try the new candy. Wow. It's very good. Like a fluffy marshmallow. I'm sure if you left it longer, it would probably harden even more. I want to try it. Candies are pretty hard. Anyways, guys, that's it for this month's Tokyo Treat unboxing. Um, like I said earlier, you can check out Tokyo Treat in the description below. Um, I am absolutely blown away by the quality of these boxes. I love that they included this little uh, book here with some um, interesting information about Japan, cool places in Japan. Uh, they've got a Tokyo Treat community page there. Really cool that they added this stuff. And like I said, the little guide for the kits is, is definitely a bonus. So. I have tried several of these treat boxes and this is by far my favorite. I highly recommend you guys try this out. Like I said, feel free to check the uh, link in the description below. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching and um, as always, check out uh, CJR on Instagram and Facebook. And uh, till the next episode.